Hi guys, welcome back. I'm Shivanti. So yeah, I'm in Bellore, and also yeah, my face looks really really fat, and I don't know what to do with it. Please don't come and ask me for any weight gain tips. No, no, it's all about the flavor. Okay, ba. I'll kill you. Definitely, I'll kill you. So please don't come and ask me for any weight gain tips. Anyway, I'm quite excited for this Diwali because it's gonna be my third Diwali, so it's kind of special, and I'm very very excited for that. Also, I think I haven't posted a Diwali get ready with me as such in the past. <laughs> I have actually posted one video long ago, long long ago. Hi guys, welcome back. So this is officially my second video in the festive series, and I'm excited and nervous at the same time because it's gonna be a makeup tutorial. I know, I know. That is the reason why I don't want to talk about it. And also from now on, this is gonna be officially my first ever Diwali get ready with me video. And for my foundation, I'm using Max Studio Fix Fluid. Just pretend that you don't see anything. Today I'll just try and keep my bala bala kola kola mouth shut. I mean I'm not promising anything, cause in all my videos, I mean in almost all my videos, I say this, but then that video ends up being the longest one. So I'm not promising anything. Chuma disclaimer mari apa apa vandi ida sodi to pova. It's not that I will follow, but what to do? This thing and this thing is never under my control. I don't know. In most of my videos, without shame, I would have called myself. I would have called myself kuda illa. Without shame, I would have accepted the fact that I am a mental case. I'm a mentally ill person. So I. Part single psycho and whatnot, but still there are few people. Now, let's get on with today's video. I want to create a nice and simple look, and for that, I'm going to start off with skincare. Arika, I'm going to use this. You people know already that I will be using this. It's my recent time obsession. I just love this product. Why isn't this focusing? Now super focus out the so yeah this is the product that I'm gonna be using. It's just a hydrating mist from Pixi. It has my heart. I mean, you cannot use this as a substitute for a moisturizer. It's just a mist. I mean, it's not supremely hydrating as what I would like to, you know, add. So basically, you can use this as a base, like I'm using right now, or you can use this uh, on top of your makeup. And I'm gonna use paniklam, but you cannot use this in the place of a moisturizer. I just love how this adds a beautiful glow to my face. I'm gonna apply some moisturizer. And then I'm gonna apply some sunscreen. So basically, if it's in the morning, I'll just apply the sunscreen, and if it's in the night, I'll just apply the moisturizer. I don't apply both, but since it's for the video, and also since I'm scared of you guys, I'm applying both today. No, going to bumblebee is coming inside my room. What to do? Which bumblebee? Ki kaadi ki kaado. Anyway, I'm scared of you guys. That's why I'm applying both in today's video. Still, someone in the comment section will be like. Today you didn't use primer. I have done a van danda, but we want. Up you go and use no, no. First you use. We'll see how the product behaves on your skin, and then only we'll decide whether to buy the product or not itself. <laughs> Very good. Even today I don't have a primer, but I'll get one soon. Okay. I'm gonna color correct my face. It is such a crucial step for me because I have some discoloration going on around my eyes, and I wanted it to be evened out before applying any eyeshadow. <coughs> So that's the reason why I want to go ahead and apply little bit of corrector on top of places where I do have discolorations. That is about my eyelids. Now I'm gonna use foundation, and for that I'm gonna be using this. It's the Dermacos Two Percent Nice and Amide High Coverage Foundation, and they weren't joking when they said high coverage foundation because I used this in one of my shots. I think I haven't posted it yet, but I'll soon post it. So in that shots, you know, I was just blown away by the coverage of this, and it also blended into my skin so seamlessly. I wouldn't have even used a brush in that shots. It's so effortlessly blended into my skin. And after I was done with the shots, I had my makeup. Throughout the day, trust me when I say this, it was super lightweight. I'm not even kidding, and it's not because the video is sponsored or anything. Genuinely, it was so so lightweight on my skin. Because at the end of the day, when I was about to wash my face, you know, I didn't even feel like I was having makeup on my face. I just splattered water on my face, and that's when I realized, oh my god, I have to remove my makeup. They say that it has 12 hours long stay and also 12 hours oil control. As long as I had this on my face yesterday, I didn't feel like my makeup was breaking at any point. And also, at the end of the day, I didn't feel oily or sticky. Also, see so many other YouTubers raving about this product. I genuinely, genuinely, genuinely recommend this foundation to you guys. Just beautifully blends into the skin. Can you see that? You just need a little bit of the product. 
Can you see the coverage? Damn good, no? Seriously high coverage. Can you see the difference? It has 1% hyaluronic acid to hydrate and plump up your skin and, and it also has 2% niacinamide which is gonna, you know, help reduce your dark spots and even out your skin from within. Very important, it has SPF 50, 50 like 40, PA++++. For TA, it's really high for a makeup product. So I genuinely, genuinely recommend this product to you guys. It's so good. It actually comes in seven different shades and it's also sweat and water resistant. You can use my coupon code to get 20% off on their website and every time you purchase from them your order will be linked with a child that they help educate along with Boomi and they have empowered 10,000 plus students this year with a young scientists initiative all Dermaco products are fragrance free and I wish they come up with more makeup products because I love makeup more than skincare now I'm gonna apply a little bit of concealer just on top of my eyelids where I have the discoloration going on not very little concealer because the foundation itself was full coverage so i didn't need much then i'm gonna use some powder to set my face first this charlotte tilbury powder to you know set around my eyes same old products that i use in all my other videos as well because if something is nice why do you have to change it right and also not just that <laughs> can you see the glow this foundation gives seriously it's a, such a good product you definitely have to give it a shot and on rest of my face, face is Canada, as usual. Now I'm gonna fill in my eyebrows and for that, say what I'm gonna use? I'm gonna use this. This is from Chamasi Milano. This is the thing that I'm currently obsessed with. This is a basic eyebrow enhancer. It's so, so good. And for years I've been using the Miss Plus eyebrow cake. I mean, I still use it, but recently I'm gravitating a lot towards this one. So in case if you are someone who's been following me for a while, you know how long I've been using that Miss Plus one. And now, as I said, I'm liking this a little more than the eye, the eyebrow cake thingy. It also comes with a spoolie. Next eyeshadow, and for that I'm gonna use this palette from NYX. It's a beautiful palette. It's called Festival. I'm in love with it. Again, the same palette which I used in my last video as well. But the eye look is gonna be totally different because you can totally create different different eye looks with one single palette. No, another couple. First, I'm gonna take this black shade and apply it under my. I mean in my lower lash line then I'm gonna use this brown shade as my transition shade it's supremely pigmented I mean the palette is so pigmented and now are they black shade which I'm gonna work on my upper eyelids as well now I'm gonna take a kajal and intensify the line And then I'm gonna take this glittery shade. This is not dirt by the way, it's kajal. So I'm gonna take this shade. I'm in love with my eye look. I don't know how far the camera is picking it up, but it looks so beautiful in real life. Now for blush, I'm gonna use this from Simply Nam. This is another favorite of mine. And this brush is in the shade Soul Sister. Diwali, I'm also gonna apply a little bit of highlighter, which I usually don't do. So for highlighter, I'm gonna use this Charlotte Tilbury palette and I'm gonna use this particular shade. So pretty. I'm gonna apply a lip liner from MAC. This is called Mahogany. I mean, the shade is called Mahogany. Line my lips. Smudge it out a little. And for lipstick, I'm gonna use this lip stack from Kiro. I have a separate video for this. I don't know if I would have uploaded by the time I upload this video. But anyway, this is one of my current favorite products. I just love all the nude lipsticks that this has. Nice, huh? my best but the glitter is not picking up in the camera it looks stunning in real life so yeah this is how i look i seriously don't know how to give this aesthetic looks and all so please bear with me mm -hmm. 
with that we have come to the end of the video thank you so much for hanging on till the end in case if you like the video please don't forget to hit the like button and also share it with your friends subscribe to my channel that's it Ta -ta.